Good evening, City Council. My name is Francesco Papalia. Uh, I've been an enthusiastic home vegetable gardener here in Albany since 1987. In the last few years, I have planted an apricot, fig, persimmon, pomegranate, mandarin orange trees in my backyard. My strawberry patch seems, unfortunately, to be nourishing mostly the local squirrel rather than my morning treats, but that's the way it goes. My vegetable garden includes kale, spinach, arugula, sugar snap peas, cucumbers, and three kinds of tomatoes. My herb garden has parsley, rosemary, oregano, and six kinds of basil. Today I picked up a five gallon bucket of coffee grounds from Pete's Coffee to use as a good nitrogen source for my compost bin. I have done all of this on my small 3,300 square foot lot in Albany, somehow without the help of the Farm Alliance or the University of California. For those of us who have lived in Albany and who have diligently followed the four year process with the University for the development of a sorely needed commercial development that includes a Whole Foods store and 172 units of assisted senior living housing and have participated in an open, democratic, transparent dialogue between the citizens of Albany, the Planning Commission, the City Council and the staff of local businesses. I am dismayed, like others in this town, that uh, after we've sat through some tedious meetings to speak out and voice our support for and against this project, and after four years that we came to an agreement, that today a very, very small group have decided that they haven't even been part of the process for the last four years, but that's okay. They know what they want, and they're just going to take it to use for what they want. Researchers, little leaguers, cyclists, seniors, merchants, UC planners, everyone else, the farmer's market that's operating next year, that doesn't matter. They make up their own rules about due process and democracy. They've even declared themselves exempt from state management today and ask you to participate in that. They make up uh, their own set of facts about the present and the past. Their tactics and objectives, and objectives flow from self-serving rules and misinformation. This is a veritable land grab by a few. You were elected to serve us and all of the people of Albany. Please honor the process, the democratic process that we've been working at for four years, and don't let a minority, a minuscule minority, capture the entire process. Thank you. Thank you. Next.